every week, JC goes to the supermarket to buy supplies for her family. Aside from meat, vegetables, and fish, JC has to buy milk and diapers for her baby, all from her weekly 5,000 peso budget. She said that usually she opts to buy in bulk to save more, but lately she had to purchase fewer items due to higher prices of goods. Usually, I bought for two weeks, now I bought for a week. So, the budget we have for every week. So, mas matipid kasi siya. Mas umonte, syempre. Ang taas ng bilihan eh, taas ng presyo ngayon eh. However, the DTI said that the price hike is looming in the coming days. The suggested retail price that the agency published showed at least 50 centavo to 3 peso increase in several basic commodities like canned goods and instant noodles. Even milk, coffee, and sugar will also see an increase in SRP. Prices of condiments are also expected to go up, while non-food items like soap and candles will see an increase of 1 peso to more than 20 pesos. But during its inspection on Wednesday, Day. The DDI said prices remain the same as most supermarkets are still selling old stocks. Manami pa kaming pending na, <laughs> na hindi na isama dito sa August 29 publication. Marami pa pong produkto na, na iniwan na muna natin para lang uh, hindi rin mabigla masyado ang consumer. Hindi... Despite this, some consumers like Milde have started to buy supplies they will use for Noche Buena. As early as now then, even yung pang Christmas na gagamitin namin, we are already starting na, na maipon. Para then, uh, aside from, alam naman natin tataas yung presyo, kung if ever, maiwasan din namin yung pagsama sa mas maraming tao na crowded area during bear months, especially mga tao mamimili for their Christmas na panghanda. But what Milde did is just right as some manufacturers are already asking for an increase in prices of Noche Buena items. In 2020, manufacturers already agreed not to increase prices and instead use the 2019 SRP. The DDI, however, said that they will still try to appeal to manufacturers and not to increase prices as the pandemic continues. For News 5, Dale Devera, we're One News.